my ankle twisted outwards and almost from that moment I knew something was wrong. We were doing warm up sprints on a little bit of wet grass, playing baseball. I was so scared about what was gonna happen. But then when I got there and learned the process of everything and how fast everything's gonna go, it really made me a lot more comfortable with what was gonna happen. Not every patient who sprains their ankle requires an ankle reconstructive surgery. The surgery is primarily designed for patients who have chronic ankle instability, and that instability needs to affect your quality of life, your recreational activities, or your sport. There are two primary procedures we perform for that, a repair or a reconstruction. In a repair, we're repairing your torn ligaments back to the fibula to restore the anatomy. In the case of a reconstruction, you may not have sufficient ligament to repair, and this will require reconstruction. When you get there, they kind of go over things with you, how it's going to be, how you get to go home the same day. I started physical therapy after two weeks of rest. Following surgery, your ankle initially will be swollen and painful, and that is phase one of physical therapy, where we work on pain control and controlling the swelling in your ankle. Once you get through phase two of your therapy, your ankle will feel stable, and you can start focusing on getting back into shape and returning to sport. I'd recommend to anyone is once you get diagnosed with ankle instability that you get surgery as soon as possible because it truly has put me on the path back to being a good athlete again.